out in my garden and all my cabbage that I had in my red raised garden bed are bolting so I'm going to go ahead and harvest them and I don't need to keep the seeds because I have a lot of these seeds so I wanted to harvest these and then I'm going to just cut them at the bottom and leave the roots in so it can help the beans but as you can see my beans are coming in celery is looking good and I've taken the netting off of here so I'm just going to go ahead and harvest these and check out these there's some good good eating right here I should have had a bowl but you know when you come out to harvest you never think about bringing a bowl out here so I'm just going to harvest this one so I can have these for dinner tonight for sure. So let me go back in the house and get a bowl for this because I got all these plants here to harvest and I want to make sure that I have a container to put them in. Hold on you guys. I'm going to go ahead and harvest these. I hope you can hear me because it's so sunny out here and the wind is really, really whipping out here. So. I'm just going to do the best that I can do. I'm just going to harvest these off of here. That in my compost pile. Let that part keep growing. Go ahead and get these ones off. Give it room for my lima beans and stuff to grow. You hear the wind out here? It is whipping. Whipping, whipping. I don't know if you guys can see that. Can you see that? Let me bring it down a little bit more. Sorry, the camera's shaking because it's the wind out here. It ain't playing around. Whoop. See, what I tell you about the wind? Sorry, sorry. This wind is no joke. Let me see if I can prop this up on here. Maybe I gotta give it a little bit more stability. Hey, technical difficulties. This wind is not going to let me be great today. Can you guys still see that? Let me see if I, if I try to hold it. are doing really good so happy about that so let's cut this part off let me see all right that's off okay let's see if we can get you to go this way stay camera we have to do it real quick before the the wind come back cabbage. Trust and believe you're cooking these up today. Let's 
me some good old onion, some garlic. Yeah. Look at that. Those are good leaves. Look at my bowl. Nice size bowl, too. Look at all that. Good, good, good. Happy, happy. Alright, I'm going to go ahead and finish the other two because this wind is no joke. And I'll come back and let's see how much I've harvested. Here is all my collard greens. They're not all of them. I didn't pick all of them out there because I want to give these a try and do a little bit now that I'm going to pick the rest of them and I'm going to blanch them and put them in the freezer so I will have them for later. But look how beautiful these cabbage leaves are. Aren't they gorgeous? Beautiful. All right, guys. So I'm about to wash them, cook them up, and we're going to be enjoying these for dinner tonight. All right, guys. Hope you enjoyed this video. Like I said, even though the weather is horrible out there, windy and cold, keep on pushing. Keep on pushing because that's what gardeners do. We don't let the bad weather stop us. If we know we got food that we need to um, grow for our families and our friends, will motivate us to keep on going. All right, guys, have a wonderful day. Have a blessed day. And Miss Renee will see you in the next video. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel. Look at those beautiful, beautiful collard, no, cabbage leaves. Woohoo! Beautiful.